the Missile Defense Agency, MDA, has launched a search to identify potential industry partners capable of supporting the production and future upgrades of the Army Navy slash Transportable Radar Surveillance and Control Model 2 and slash TPY-2 radar. This advanced radar system is a key component of the United States Missile Defense System, MDS, and the MDA's recent request for information, RFI, aims to evaluate the capabilities of companies that can meet the agency's evolving needs. The in tpy 2 is a sophisticated missile defense radar designed to detect, track, and discriminate ballistic missiles. Operating in the X-band of the electromagnetic spectrum, the radar excels in identifying targets and distinguishing between genuine threats and non-threats, such as launch debris. Its precision and reliability make it an essential tool in countering the increasing threat of ballistic missiles, providing a robust defense against a wide range of missile threats. The radar operates in two distinct modes, forward-based mode and terminal mode. In forward-based mode, the in tpy 2 radar detects ballistic missiles shortly after launch, providing early warning and tracking capabilities. In terminal mode, the radar guides interceptors toward descending missiles, ensuring the successful neutralization of the threat. Notably, in this mode, the in tpy 2 radar plays a critical role in leading the Terminal High Altitude Area Defense, THAAD, missile defense system, guiding the THAAD missile to its target. The radar's performance in this capacity has been proven effective against all classes of ballistic missiles. According to a notice from the MDA's Ground Sensors Directorate, the agency is actively exploring sources capable of managing the production of an slash TPY, two radars, components, spares, and fleet refurbishment activities. The MDA is also seeking to identify potential upgrades that could enhance the radar's capabilities to address emerging threats. These upgrades may include improved digital control and processing, expanded detection and tracking abilities, increased field of view, greater power and sensitivity, and enhanced self-defense features. The RFI makes it clear that this initiative is intended solely for information and planning purposes. It does not constitute a request for proposal, RFP, or indicate a commitment to establish a contract. As such, the MDA will not accept proposals at this stage, nor will it provide feedback on submissions. Participation in this RFI does not guarantee involvement in future procurement opportunities, but it offers a platform for companies to demonstrate their capabilities and align with the MDA's future requirements. In addition to production and upgrade capabilities, the MDA is seeking information on technical support, systems engineering, integrated logistics, and program management functions necessary to maintain and sustain the in tpy 2 radar systems. Expertise in areas such as obsolescence mitigation, hardware redesign, technology integration, and refurbishment efforts is particularly valued. Respondents to the RFI are encouraged to provide detailed information on their experience with expand radar capabilities, manufacturing processes, system integration, testing, and the production of an-slash-TPY-2 radar components. Companies are also invited to discuss risk mitigation strategies, especially in areas such as production learning curve impacts, failure analysis, and adherence to MDA mission assurance provisions, MAP, and parts, materials, and processes, PMP, compliance. The MDA's RFI represents a critical step in ensuring the continued effectiveness of the in tpy 2 radar system, which remains a cornerstone of the nation's missile defense strategy. By engaging with industry partners, the MDA aims to sustain and enhance this vital capability in the face of evolving missile threats.